Well, I'm flying into Texas. I don't want to die. Put on a pop for necktie. Kiss my mom goodbye. So I leave this dirty city, all the hate and all the blood. Got my Bible in a suitcase, and I think that's quite enough. I think that's quite enough. I missed that by a second That could have been me Young boy in the ground now And still they do not see So I leave this dirty city All the hate and all the blood Got my Bible in a suitcase And I think that's quite enough I think that's quite enough That's quite enough. So much everybody we're Beck brothers and we're so excited to be here Certain. I couldn't say too much. I 
Didn't know how they hurt Wiping all your tears On the inside of your shirt How could something perfect Also come with time to grieve Laying on my chest Listening to my heart beat And all we do was lay Enjoyed each other The future was uncertain We couldn't say too much That night Beck Brothers, and uh, we're in Salt Lake City at the Gallivan Center with excellence in the community, and let me tell you, we are so excited to be here with you tonight. We've got a fun set planned for you, and uh, here's the thing with Beck Brothers shows. You guys got to cheer really loud. Can I hear you? There we go. So everybody here is going to have a good time, and you know, maybe people back home listening uh, through the live stream will too. This next one, we're going to have Isaac switch over to mandolin, and this one's called Mamas Be Careful. It's just about... Making sure you're there for the ones you love. One, two, three, one, two. <laughs> Town. And I like the way she smiled. Well, the smiles kept it coming. We fell in love. And so I asked her to be my wife. But learn new things over time. And I learned this girl had it bad. She was a little younger, her mom passed away. And that was the day that little girl died. Just so mama hugs, be careful, and tell them you love them. Cause my baby misses her so. She's grown up a foot and followed her dreams. But her mom is not here to see It's social way to see her again Let's hear some guitars, eh? Crying from worry. I saw 
someday she might forget Those days when she was younger and her mom was around That was the day that little girl died so Mama, hus, be careful and tell them you love them Cause my baby misses her so She's grown up a foot And followed her dreams But her mom is not here to see The social way to see her again Just so mama hus be careful And tell them you love them Cause my baby misses her so She's grown up a foot And followed her dreams But her mom is not here to see The social way to see her again The social way to see her again Thank you. Thank you guys so much. We're super excited, like Skylar said, to be here playing a set for y'all. Uh, we appreciate all those tuning in back home, wherever you may be. Um, we're, we're excited. We're going to play some originals and some covers for you. We've been playing originals so far. And we're going to keep that train going with another one called Hope Again. I'll sing this one here for you. But you can, uh, we're super excited. This is our first year playing as a band. And, super uh, fresh. We're working on some music. We have three songs out on Spotify. You can go stream under Beck Brothers, as well as follow us on social media, wherever you prefer to get your social on. We, uh, yeah, we'll kick this one off here.
Thank you so much. Let me get Isaac switched back over to mandolin right now. The thing with going to a bluegrass concert, a country concert, is you got to give time for the tuning. And it's not as much for us, but it's also for you guys. Trust me, you want us to tune. We tune because we care, trust us. And we tune because we know you care. I heard that one recently. This is that one we just released, that new single I was talking about, Anywhere Where You Can Listen to Music. It's called Living for Life. Well, no more sleep for me anymore to pay those paper bills for me and my little one softly sleeping still no amount can be quite enough to pay the sacrifice if there's one thing that i'm doing here it's that i'm living for life well it's in the air that i breathe each morning in the eyes that I see every night If there's one thing that I'm doing here It's that I'm living for life No more bottles or cigarettes will get me on my feet and work until the light goes out to keep him off that street. Promises made long ago to my dear wife. If there's one thing that I'm doing here, it's that I'm living for life. Well, it's in the air that I breathe each morning, and the eyes that I see every night. If there's one thing that I'm doing here, it's that I'm living. On that night at the hospital, the midwife came and went and told her she wouldn't be around and hopes it was well spent. With the loss of her precious life, she brought a new one in. She said, if there's one thing that I'm doing here It's that I'm leaving for life Well, it's in the air that I breathe each morning And the eyes that I see every night If there's one thing that I'm doing here It's that I'm living for life well, It's in the air that I breathe each morning and the eyes that I see every night if there's one thing that I'm doing here it's that I'm living for life the holiday season 
when does everybody celebrate? Is it December 1st? Anybody celebrate December 1st? What about after Thanksgiving? Do people celebrate after Thanksgiving? What about after Halloween? Any day after Halloween. There we go. That's my wife. She's after, she's after Halloween. So I guess I can't say it's, it's now a Christmas season because it's been there for a while. But, you know, uh, Zach and I are brothers, the Beck brothers, and uh, we grew up playing bluegrass with our grandparents all the time. And we went to competitions. We, uh, you know, performed all over the, the, the country. And, you know, some of the busiest times of the year were during the holidays. Uh, whether it be, you know, playing for an old folks home or, or uh, playing for, for the, the church program or, um, you know, playing for just neighbors, really. It was a lot during Christmas time. And this is actually one of those songs that we actually played with our grandpa quite often. It's Frosty the Snowman. So, uh, you know, it's that time of the year, so I decided to be a little festive here for you tonight. So, uh, <laughs> Merry Early Christmas. <laughs> Like Skylar mentioned, um, they, went, they used to go to competitions uh, around the area, and um, that's actually how we met, the three of us. Uh, we all used to go to these instrument competitions when we were little kids, starting at about age six, probably, six or seven, right? Um, and so, Zach and I, we actually began as arch nemeses. Is that how you say it? We, uh, we both competed on guitar at these contests, and we would go back and forth winning each year. And so, that's how we began as a rivalry, right? But we made up, and... We're good friends now, so but we're happy to play together. Uh, we do like to keep a uh, healthy rivalry alive, though, sometimes, and you know, just uh, make sure we're uh, keeping our place in the band. <laughs>
You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. You are my sunshine, my only sunshine. You make me happy when skies are gray. You'll never know, dear, how much I love you. Please don't take my sunshine away. I'll fly away your oh glory. I'll fly away when I die. Hallelujah, I'll fly away. So I'll fly away your oh glory. I'll fly away when I die. Hallelujah, I'm back. One more for you guys. See if you know it. Will the circle be unbroken by and by, Lord, by and by? There's another home away in the sky, Lord, in the sky. Will the circle be unbroken by and by, Lord, by and by? There's another home away in the sky, Lord, in the sky. to stick to our bluegrass roots here. Who do you think won? <laughs> I think they said Isaac. Speaking of the man over on the banjo, this is a good chance to introduce the man, the myth, the legend, the man that you've grown to love over the course of the last 20 or so minutes. And we'll keep growing that love as we continue to play. Like, uh, like he mentioned, we, uh, we've grown up knowing each other for a while now. We're super honored to have him here in the band. He plays a mean banjo, a mean mandolin, and a mean guitar, and probably 50 other instruments I don't even know about. He's a really talented musician, and we're so lucky to have him. Please make him welcome, Isaac Gesslesen. <laughs> he'll kick this next one off for us. Is the day that I 
see my dear. Oh, go home to the one I love the most. The one I love the most. I'm headed. One I love the most, I'm headed down the coast. I'll go home to the one I love the most. The one I love the most, don't you cry when I go. Thank you. Zach said towards the beginning of the set, we've, uh, we've actually only been a full band for about a year. We're brand new to this whole, this whole music scene. Make sure I don't start coughing on everybody up here. Uh, we started actually a few, well, Zach and I started playing music again a few years ago after, you know, not playing for a while. You know, we both started careers, we both had other music projects, and, and we finally decided to go back to our roots and play a little bit more bluegrass. And so we, uh, we started writing some songs and a this is actually a song I wrote with a with a buddy of mine, and we decided to um, you know to release it under Beck Brothers. And so uh, um, we did all the work, we got it recorded. Um, we actually started having some people playing with us, and uh, you know, sadly, a worldwide pandemic started, and it kind of crushed all of those plans for a minute. So we released that, and uh, fast forward a couple of years, we uh, reached out to a few buddy, buddies of ours, and. Uh, you know, we're here playing for you, and so it's, it's been a really fun year, you know, we've, uh, we've been able to play um, a lot of great festivals, and uh, just looking forward to the future as well. And uh, looks like Zach is trying to uh, fix something for his monitors, so uh, uh, during that time, I guess I can talk about how we started. Zach actually started playing guitar when he was, what, four years old, would you say? Four years old on a baritone ukulele. Yeah, and the spoons. My grandma's actually in the crowd tonight, and she said, don't forget the spoons. He played the wooden spoons. Give it up for the wooden Thank spoons, you. everybody! On the wooden spoon. I didn't bring them tonight, but I should have. <laughs> He's our favorite spoonist. <laughs> this, uh, this uh, back to the original uh, story of the starting of Beck Brothers. This is that first song we recorded called Good Ones. This kind of matches, uh, matches the sad... COVID too. Oh, I 
do the good ones always go? Oh, why don't they ever, ever ask for more? Oh, why do the good ones always go? Oh, why, oh, why? Oh, why do the good ones always go? Oh, why don't they ever, ever ask for Thank you so much. Well, it's now my privilege to introduce the man back here, keeping us together. He not only plays the kick drum, he plays the snare drum. He not only plays the snare drum, he plays the floor tom and the hi-hat and three cymbals at the same time. We're super lucky to have him. He plays a multitude of other instruments just besides drums, but we're lucky to have him back there keeping us together. Mr. Jackson Tubbs, make him feel welcome. We're going we're gonna to play a bluegrass tradi traditional tune that me and Skylar used to play. Say that one play. more time. A bluegrass traditional <laughs> tune that me and Skylar would play when we were younger. It's called Your Love is Like a Flower, and he's going to kick this one off for us. the banjo guys it's always the banjo you know what they say about banjos though huh? you spend uh, half your time tuning the other half playing out of tune ah. <laughs> I hope it's a good enough tune for you guys tonight though. We were sitting on the banks of the stream When you whispered so softly, I love you And those waters murmured a tune Oh, they tell me your love's like a flower In the springtime, the blossoms so fair In the fall, when the weather's way dear And they tell me that's the way of your love Let's hear some guitar
Those flowers are blooming so fair But today as the snow falls around us I can see that your love is not there Oh, they tell me your love's like flower In the springtime I blossom so fair In the fall when it withers away, dear And they tell me that's the way One more time, everybody Oh, they tell me your love's like flower In the springtime I blossom so fair In the fall when it withers away, dear And they tell me that's the way of your love Thank you. Zach, why don't you and I play a couple? Is that cool with you? Is that okay with you, Zach, and I just play a couple real quick? (laughs) Kind of don't have a choice. (laughs) So uh, one of the songs that Zach and I started singing, you know, to a little bit when we were younger is a song by the Abbott Brothers called Murdered in the City. For some weird reason, I really like this song. It talks about two brothers. And maybe I'm just really sentimental, right? If I get murdered in the city, don't go revenging in my name. Prison death from such is plenty No need to go get locked away When I leave your arms The things that I think of No need to go get over long I'm coming home I wonder which brother was better Which one our parents loved the most I sure did get in lots of trouble They seemed to let the other go A tear fell from my father's eye I wonder what my dad would say He said I love you And I'm proud of you both in so many different ways. If I get murdered in the city, go read the letters in my desk. Don't bother with all my belongings. Pay attention to the list. Tell my sister that I loved her Tell my mother the same Always remember there is nothing worth sharing Like the love that let us share our name Always remember there is nothing worth sharing Like the love that let us share our name Share a name. We're going to invite our grandpa up and play with us. Everybody, give it up for grandpa. Yeah. We're, we're super excited. We, we haven't done this in a little bit. It's been a while. COVID's kind of thrown a wrench in everyone's plans, and we've never quite gotten back to playing with our grandpa as much as we would hope we would have. But we're super excited. This, uh, this song we're going to play here, we're going to bring yeah, Isaac back up here. And um, this was written by a local musician in a band um, called Cold Creek. Thank you. For some reason, I was thinking Cripple Creek, which is the name of a song. <laughs> it's the band Cold Creek. It's called Bill's Reel. And uh, yeah, one of those tunes we played when we were younger. Here it is.
Don Davis, everybody. I need his pick still. So while Skyler's, uh, Skyler's grabbing that guitar, um, we, I can't help but come back to the, to just be so grateful for um, excellence in the community having us out tonight. You know, it's been a, it's been a real honor. It's been really fun to play for you guys and all those back home. And um, it's not possible to make this happen. You know, I, there's so many concerts that, that go on and so many great artists, local artists that are able to be supported by this amazing organization. And that's done through amazing and generous sponsors. And uh, I'm going to turn to my left for Skyler that has that list of those sponsors to read off to you right now. We are very, very grateful um, for Talitha Day and the Gallivan Center for, you know, uh, enabling us to have a great venue here. And the Salt Lake City Redevelopment Agency, the Salt Lake City Mayor, Aaron Mendenhall. The Salt Lake City Council, Zoo and Arts and Parks. Taylor Audiovisual. Everybody give it up for Taylor Audiovisual for uh, providing some awesome sound and video for everybody back at home. The Utah Division of Arts and Museums. <laughs> I'm going to say that wrong. My wife's going to make fun of me on the way home. The Larry Miller Family Charities. George S. and Dolores Duray Eccles Foundation. Merit Medical. Dane's Music, which provides the piano, which sadly we're not playing tonight. AARP. R. Harold Burton Foundation. And Excellence. And of course, Jeff Whiteley and the crew. And we're so very grateful. Everybody give it a hand for every single one of these sponsors. Without them, this couldn't be... Uh, this wouldn't be happening. We are so very grateful for them. And you might be asking yourselves right now, well, Skyler, this is amazing. I'm having a really awesome time. How can I support this? How can I donate? And actually, there's a way you can. Uh, on each side of the stage, there's a QR code that you can actually donate to. Um, and, you know, it can allow us to have awesome concerts. And, uh, you know, we also have some... Uh, handouts right here as well if anybody wants them. Uh, but again, we are so very grateful for Excellence and, you know, a lot of the work they do. So everybody, one more time, give it up for Excellence in the community and all these amazing sponsors. This, uh, this next one is one of the songs that we do have out right now. It's called If This Town Could Talk. It was about, uh, based on just my time in this little town called Tucumcari, New Mexico, where... Um, is where the movie Cars was based off of, actually, fun fact, and uh, a lot of other small towns along Route 66. And um, I found you to move your capo, Skyler. Yeah, thanks. And uh, thanks, Grandpa. Thanks, thanks, Grandpa. <laughs> Everyone, Grandpa, Don hey, Davis. Don Davis, everybody! We'd be playing the wrong key without him. <laughs> um, but yeah, like, like the movie Cars, it, uh, there was this little town that, that blew up, metaphorically. It was just like lots, lots of population growth. <laughs> And um, everyone wanted to move to this town, and due to one reason or another, slowly but surely, these people left for the bigger city. And um, it, it's kind of hard but not to, to ask yourself, what would this town say if it could talk? So, if this town could talk, ladies and gentlemen.
to keep you here well, I will battle for your love now for your love If this town could talk could tell you stories from before Stories about how people danced and always wanted more If this town could talk it would then go on to say How this old town was quiet down And how they went away this guitar off of me and not play it again. I'm going to unplug the acoustic. How you guys doing out there? You doing okay? Good, good, good. I said the lights were coming back. I will keep that promise to you guys right now.
join us if you want. We're going to be singing the first verse of Silent Night. Thank you, everybody. And I don't know about you, but I'm about to fall asleep. So uh, I want to play something that some people might, might recognize in here. Is anybody a fan of bluegrass out here? See, I love to hear that. I love to hear that. But usually for us, that's not the case. Some people are usually, what is bluegrass? Never heard of it. Who is that? I had never heard of him before I met you. <laughs> yeah. He had to convince me to play with him because I thought this was, I thought this was country music. I was like, nah, I don't do that. But he was like, nah, bluegrass is cool country. So I got down with it. But here's the thing. You might have heard this song. It's actually from a local artist, believe it or not. I believe, at least. So if you recognize this one, please sing along. I also want to take just a few seconds and introduce my very best friend, Jed Bradshaw. Everybody give it up for Jed. I love that man. Jed and I have been playing music for a very long time, 11 years now. And some of you might think, wow, these young kids, but hey, for me, that's a long time. It's been an absolute blast. Jed plays a really great guitar and a lot of other instruments, and especially a lot of different genres, but we're very lucky to have him playing with us in our very, our very nice bluegrass band. A little different.
I dare you to do something Waiting on you again So I don't take the blame Run away, we're running circles Run away, run away, run away has a very complicated chorus everybody I don't know if you're I don't think you can sing it might be too complicated it goes move on you think you can sing it okay well some of you said you could so I'm expecting it lover since high school dropped out moved off to another place to start their new life Life hit them hard, they were living in their car When they found a way to get rid of pain They shot a half the night like they did all the time The baby lays in the backseat They knew it's enough when the cops locked them up judge looked at him and said, please, move on, move on, from all of the hard things that you've done.
I think we need to kick it up. What do you think? I think so. I think so. It's now my favorite time of the night. The night that I get to introduce my brother. My better half. <laughs> I've enjoyed, enjoyed playing music with him since I was three, four years old. So ever since I was tapping those wooden spoons, man, let me tell you. He's... <laughs> he's He's been great. I, I love him to death. We're, we're so lucky to have him. I'm so lucky to have him. Um, he, what, what else can I say about you? I don't think there's a fiddle You're contest. You're getting a couple parts. He, there's, there's, uh, there's probably not a fiddle contest out there that this man hasn't won. At least not, not one that I'm aware of. Make him welcome. He's going to shred a little bit for you on this next one. Mr. Skyler Beck on the fiddle. Thank you, everybody. I need everybody to clap around right here. I don't have another hand I can clap. back. more for you tonight. And this next one is actually written by Zach Beck. Him. And believe it or not, truly, this, this song's name is Zach's new song. We haven't named it yet. So if you got some ideas for the song, please come tell us right after or comment. Not that it could possibly be better than Zach's new song, but if you happen to have an idea that could beat it. Let us know or comment down below on the video. Smash that subscribe. I've always wanted to say that, guys. I've always wanted to say that. <laughs> well, until possibly tomorrow. But until then, Zach's new song here for you. Well, while you're doing that, continue. I want to introduce this guy to the right of me. To the left of me, if you're watching. Zach and I have been playing ever since I was three years old. Not a guitar competition, that's just kidding. But truly, Zach and I really have been playing our whole lives and went from competition to competition. And, you know, between Isaac and Zach going at it and competing against each other, Zach's absolutely crushed it ever since being a wee little lad. And uh, I'm very lucky to have him as a brother and as a bandmate, and it's so awesome I get to play music with him. 
So once again, everybody, Zach Beck. Just lay here for the rest of the rest of the day. We ain't late for nothing. We ain't late for our loves and disarray. Since we last talked about your family, we talked about their worries and we talked about our perfect fantasy. He didn't like me. He said I wasn't good enough for you. He said, Let's run away, dear. I'll meet you there. I'll meet you half past two. Whoa. actually um, and we, we played it up at a festival in Montana because it was, a, it was a special request and I think in our two hour set we probably played it four times because the crowd demanded that we kept playing it over and over and over again when we got sick of it when he says crowd demand they were chanting they were, they wagon, were, the, yeah, wheel, they were very, wagon wheel 
So we, we got sick of it after that festival. This is the first time in four years maybe we've touched this song again. So welcome back to this song. And this, uh, this was actually with another group that I was in at the time, and so I, I never got to experience that crowd chanting for Wagon Wheel. So I was hoping, I was hoping of tonight, we get some Wagon Wheel chants. We're just doing it once. Wagon Wheel, Wagon Wheel, Wagon Wheel. Okay, guys, we'll play Wagon Wheel for you. We'll play Wagon Wheel. playing for all of you tonight. We are the Beck Brothers. Please, please, please follow us on social media. We want, we want to see you again and uh, stream our music. We'd, uh, we'd love to get that music out there. We've got one more for you, but it's been an absolute blast playing for you all tonight. This uh, last one is called Stay Here. Right before that, we just wanted to give another shout out to Excellence in the Community um, for everything they've done. Um, let's give it up for them. Yeah.
Well, I don't want to go on anymore. I don't want to hold another close. So I just want to stop. Well, why don't we just stop? Stop here for a moment. And let me speak my mind. Because all I want is you here by my side. We don't have to hurry as long as we make up the time If it means we'll stay here for the night We'll pull over for me now You pulled me from out the crowd Wondering why Wondering how An hour from Idaho Your thoughts I can, I know Learn to give in And I'll learn to let go I don't want to go on anymore I don't want to hold another close I just want to stop Why don't we just stop Stop here for a moment and let me speak my mind Cause all I want is you here by my side We don't have to hurry as long as we make up the time If it means we'll stay here for the night This time we borrow Trying to bluff With a hand I've shown We're Searching for the words to speak Afraid this might just last the week It might be too strong Or I might be too weak I don't want to hold another close, I just want to stop, why don't we just stop? Stop here for a moment, let me speak my mind, cause all I want is you here by my side. Uh, we don't have to hurry as long as we make up the time, if it means we'll stay here for it. Thank you so much, everybody. Have a great night. Thank you.